Hey guys, really quickly, we're gonna do a DIY homemade pizza Lunchables to have on hand. One thing I've learned, we're using this, these just at home. I'll probably be prepping more for the kids for daycare in school. But, one thing I've learned, if you're having them at home or when you're making these Lunchables, don't put a sweet treat in them. Do not put a sweet treat in them. Um, if you're gonna be eating them at home, like don't put a piece of candy because that's the first thing they're gonna go after. So what I'm gonna do is do my pizza Lunchables and I'm gonna put a go-go squeeze or something of that nature in there because when I put those in there, they do eat all of it. But if I put like a sucker or a piece of chocolate, that's the first thing they go after and they don't wanna eat the food. So let me show you how we're gonna do these on a budget. Let's go ahead and start. First off, I picked up this marinara sauce probably back like three months ago and I just recently used it for our Bosco sticks. We got at Dollar Tree and they're really good. This is really good. So I ended up saving it, putting it in the fridge. I only opened it like two or three days ago and it was $1.25 for 24 ounces. So we're going to use that as our pizza sauce. Then Stonefire non-dippers from Walmart. These have to stay refrigerated. These were like a little under $4. I've got our mozzarella shredded cheese. And then I've got two packages of Hormel pepperoni original from Dollar Tree. We may not use all of them. If not, that's okay. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. If you don't have divided containers, just take some regular Tupperware and get you some little dividers like this from Dollar Tree, but just make sure that they do fit in these containers or whatever containers you're gonna use. So here I am taking the pizza sauce out, stirring it up a little bit, putting one in each cup, mozzarella cheese in a cup. I always put the lids on them. And then I did about four to five pepperonis per Lunchable and three non dippers. Um, they were actually bigger than I thought they were gonna be. So it worked out fine. And about three of them equal two of the little breads and the pizza Lunchables. I only did four Lunchables because I only had enough con little containers to go into four but i still have a ton of stuff left over so once those are eaten i will definitely make some more we just already had some meat and cheese lunchables still left over so you typically i have enough containers for like 10 lunchables and we just have enough in the fridge and i didn't have any more supplies so i hope y'all enjoyed this and i'll see you next time